working on the new kit. For you two, we were all new ones, in case you forgot. I've got eyes on the target. <laughs> and I've got eyes on me. <laughs> all I see is another unruly <laughs> peasant. It wouldn't be the first time the Psychonauts underestimated Maligula's power. I wish this had more troops on it. I get CPU usage, which does not equal the CPU usage that um, at least game bar is giving me. <clears throat> so I feel like it's not bad accurate. Anyways. Hmm? Action error. Dear True Psychic Tales Magazine, it's me again, Rasputin Aquato. I know I write a lot, and you haven't printed any of my True Psychic submissions so oh. far. <laughs> but this one's different. This that. one's true. I just helped <laughs> rescue Truman Zanotto, the grand yes. head of the Psychonauts, and father of Lily Zanotto, my girlfriend. Well, Although the, the uh, term is still very fresh and might need fact-checking before we go to print. There oh, was a kiss, mm -hmm. but... Okay. I'm already right. getting off track. Uh, Let me start at the beginning. I grew up in the circus, right. the Aquato Family Circus, a ragtag little caravan of acrobats run last by my parents. Three, I mean, I we were taught day. all our lives to Where's hate and fear psychics, thing? or fortune tellers as we knew them, all because of some old like thing where they cursed the Aquatos <laughs> to die in water. Problem is, I am psychic. I have been all I my life. Back and I hid my powers I from my family, this past week. practicing them in secret. So I have like until one fateful time. night, after a show, yeah, a mysterious that. stranger handed me a brochure. Uh, we'll turn that off. We don't need that sound. And I will be trying for. I think there's like two achievements I need to look out for. Um. Scroll down. <clears throat> One of them's. Where is it? I think they were impressed, which is show Mr. Pokey Lope to the, all the ca uh, camp kids. I don't know what a slice of history is. I might need to look that one up. I'm going to try to make a save before the point of no return. Because there is a point of no return where you can't, like, explore the real world anymore. Um, in general. Because, like, after you beat it, you're stuck just being able to check out the, um, all the mines you went through. That's it. Oh, yeah. Also, in this last mine, I gotta look for Edgar's secret garden. And I gotta, of course, rebrain all the kids. Um, when I do that part, I need to also turn in the scavenger hunt items. I also collected all of those. I'm actually really curious about this slice of history one real quick. Because I really don't know what that is. Um collectibles? No, I don't think they say anything in here. Alright. Yeah, I'm not sure. Do they have it in achievement guides? Point of 
like the world's scariest thing in the game. There's some pretty scary things in this game <laughs> for a kid's game. Cheap guide. <clears throat> also, I'm, I, like after I beat it today, I'm definitely going to have like... I'm going to be pretty close to having like all the achievements for sure. Oh. Okay. I need to go to the parking lot once I go back to camp. When I do my trip back to camp. I need to go to the parking lot. And that should give me... There's something there that'll give me the achievement. All right, let's go. Oh, wait. Also, that's really loud, I think. Turn that down a little. Um, Wordless gaming. There you go. Fixed. All right, let's do this. Okay. So main goal is to get past this guy here. Greetings, Dr. Lobotta. Up to the secret laboratory then, is it? One moment. You're not Dr. Lobotta. My eyes may be half gone, but I would recognize the mad doctor anywhere. He's got a stone-cold face a man doesn't easily forget. He wears a beastly smock covered in thick straps like an electric chair. And in the place where his hand should be, there's nothing but a gleaming metal claw. So if I'm not mistaken, you're not Dr. Lobotta. You don't pay my salary, so can you back away from my elevator and die? Thank you, sir. Come to pack away from my elevator and die. <laughs> okay. Up. Up here. This way. Oh, cutscene. What you paint in there? That is my patron. My psychiatrist, my warden. Looks like Dr. Lovato to me. Is he the one who chained you up? The doctor won't let me go until I complete my treatment. So why don't you just finish the painting and go home? Why don't I just... Sometimes you just have to... Huh. Hmm. You painted a bullfight over the doctor's face. Why a bullfight? Huh? Huh? Edgar, why do you... Every time! Every time it is the same! The matador! The bull! How I despise you both! But my hands won't let you go. Ah! That is why I am here, chained in more ways than you can see. A prisoner of art. A prisoner of art. Well, uh, I'm gonna go downstairs. You good? I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> All right, get that card. All right, how do I go up? Temptation? Yes. Oh, almost. Uh, Alright. Oh, yeah. Also, I'm all the way up to level 85. <clears throat> oh, yeah. that painting of Dr. Lobato coming along. You know, I'll deliver it for you as soon as it's finished. Silence! Silence. I am conceptualizing. 
All right. Let's see if we can fix you. Oh. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Ah, you try my patience, Rasputin. I didn't tell you my name. Hmm. What is this? Are you working on an abstract piece? Nice use of color. one of the more unique intros. That's an impressive house of cards you're building there. And still, not high enough to reach the sky <coughs> and free her from her prison. Who is she? I only know that she is beautiful. Perfect. And sad. All day she cries rose petal tears. And I can do nothing to help her. Because my creation lacks something, and it will not stand against the bull. What bull? El Odio. El Odio. I forget how much neon was in the song. Somewhere along the way, I feel that I lost something important. But I do not know. I think it's your queens. You want me to go look for them? Bring me any cards you find. I must complete this tower. Yes. Uh <laughs> uh. around here now that takes me back poker night with the guys man i miss those dogs uh-huh so the cards you know where they are oh right well i do know about these four lost queens but that's all can't do much with four queens can you those are exactly the cards i need yes. where are they Forget about it. They're guarded by some pretty nasty characters. Not to mention El Odio. You're better off just hanging out here and turning your head just a teensy bit to the left. Where did you say those cards were again? Forget about it. I think I hate that bull a lot. Oh, trust me. You'll hate him even more as time goes by. When he first trapped me in this alley, I thought he was only miles away. Okay, I'm off. Well, see ya. Keep off the street now. Uh, oh. Enjoy your new art there. Enjoy your new art there. Thank you. Okay. Um 142. Maybe that's the whole thing. Actually. Two vaults, it might be. Which one of my black velvet paintings? Oh, nope. 
I forgot how to use thing for a moment. Nice. Now I can get Edgar's cards. Okay. Um, before I do too much more, I'm gonna go ahead and make a save. Oh! <laughs> that was close. Okay, I'm back in here. Uh, do something with this? No, I don't think so. Velvetoria. That wall comes by really quick. I need to steam a trunk tag for this guy. If I remember correctly, this place is like pretty wide open. I can't jump over that, can I? Nope! Visible wall! Well, how do I get up there? Probably not. Ooh, there's one. something happened. Introducing, fresh from the Thrilla in Manila, Iowa, Tiger! <sighs> I forgot this was a thing. They're kinda big. Wake up, little man. Time to go nighty-night. I am awake. Good. 
Because it is bedtime for you, snack size. What are you talking about? You will fight me for my card, yes? Well, I am looking for some cards. Then, small fry, I am afraid the Sandman is going to have to bend way over to reach you because you are so awfully itty bitty. And then. All right, I get it. Just shut up and let's go. Then I will shut up, but only so I can enjoy the microscopic spectacle of your attempts to make me shut up. Uh, nope. Uh, can't do that. Uh, uh. I don't know if this will protect me, but I will try. Ah! Not working. on top of the card the whole time, huh? Like, the ring was the card. Huh. I'm back! Uh, get back here. Gotcha. Aw. Mental health. Alright, there's four more here. Somewhere. Let's get you first. Ah, there's one. Three more. Oh, duck. This one was a real pain in the butt to get. Perfect. Perfect. One step closer. Missing like three of them here. 
Oh, there's one. Two. I see two over here. Alright, there's gotta be one more somewhere. should be all the figments in this part. Another dog selling art up the street. Are you guys the uh, chain? Ah, you've met my compadres. When we were young art dogs, we would run wild in the street together. But now... Why don't you guys just make a run for it? You couldn't understand. El Odio imprisons us all. Art is the only escape. And today is the only day that is going to be this cheap. All these prices go up tomorrow because of tourist season. <laughs> Fight bulls. I have a bull problem. Bull. Sorry, artist here, delicate hands. And anyway, if you are talking about El Odio, well, there is of course only one man who could handle that much bull. Gotta go. Be good. <laughs> Actually, have a lot of arrows. Swine. <laughs> what? Nothing. Now then, you will of course want something else. Uh, yeah, oh, thank I... God. I felt like I was being looted. <laughs> right. Do I get up there? I didn't have, see any other place to, to hang anything yet. Ooh! Got the cart. I got to the next card too. I'll wait for it. I tried jumping. Nope. Okay. I'm going for the card. Grab that, whatever it was. 
I'm going for this guy. Next queen. Introducing, fresh from an astonishing victory at the Killings and Billings, Dragon! Dragon! Is one of them going to be like ox? I think one of them's ox, and I can't remember what the other one is. Yow! What's that smell? That smells like fear, boy! Yeah, no, I mean that fart smell. That's fear! No, I'm talking about an actual smell. It's like if stink bombs laid eggs and then those went bad. That's sulfur! Uh, it's part of the dragon costume, kid. Part of the dragon costume, kid. Alright. Is your oh, oh boy okay so that's what your special does ah! Very tiny sliver. Soon they'll be dragging your ass out of here. <laughs> hey, are you late? Did you hear that? Dragging <laughs> your ass out of here. Alright. Half with her. for you, Edgar. Ah, that is exactly the card I need. Another queen. Please, boy, I'm back. jumping on the house of cards, stumbling into the house of cards, driving your glowing ball through the house of cards. None of these activities help me. None of this is helping me. Got it? 
supposed to be a squirrel? I kinda wanna go down there and grab that, but... Can I make it back up? Okay, made it back up. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Okay. Wait for it. Oh! Shoot. Okay, I made it. Another one of you guys. Let me check down the alleyway first. Oh, uh, you guys. Oh, my god. Anything else down this way? Uh, sewer. Oh, the doge. What up? Edgar Tegley sent me. You know, the famous painter. How about a discount? Famous painter? Edgar? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> you don't give discounts or <laughs> you don't think he's famous? Look, I'm sorry, but eating lunch every day in the art teacher's room does not make you a famous <laughs> painter. Anyway, you only did that to hide out from the school wrestling team. Hey, there's no shame in hiding from wrestlers. They're trouble, especially the wild animal type. Oh, what do you mean, wild animals? Like dogs, eh? Oh, you got a problem with me now? No. I just meant wrestlers can be tough. I didn't mean you. Oh, you don't think I'm tough now? Why? Because I'm a Dalmatian? Hey, we can't all be St. Bernards and Bulldogs, you know. Has Edgar always had a problem with wrestlers? No way. In fact, he used to be the captain of his high school wrestling team. He took them all the way to the state semifinals one year, and then he... he choked. Cost the team the entire match. Why did he choke? Did they get him in one of those pile driver things? No. Edgar's girlfriend, Lana Panzoni, dumped him after the first period for Dean LeGrant, the head of her cheerleading squad. Techley was worthless after that. The other team just tossed him around the rest of the day like a half sack of pork rinds. Oh, man. His squad hated him after that. The whole school did. How sad. Especially since it all happened to him again with Dingo and Lampita. Oh, right. Yeah, they exist. Not made up at all, those two. Sheesh. Hey, I got some original Picassos over here if you're interested, by the way. See ya. Yes, run. Run from the horror. Run from the horror. Well, maybe you can write it off on your taxes as a loss. A catastrophic loss. Well, maybe you can write it off on your taxes as a loss. A catastrophic loss, even. Yeah, give me the horse. Yep. Ah, got it. Is there another one? Uh, you're drawing me. Okay, let me go get this card real quick before I get too far. It's down this way. What? Okay. This 
this is looking like a dead end to me. But anything up above? Okay. Let's go for the card. What do we got now? Introducing, back from a crushing victory and someone might lose a tooth in Duluth, Eagle! Eagle! Caught. Here you go, Edgar. Ah, that is exactly the card I need. Please, boy, I must have those queens. Check out the hole.
Edgar's Lament. Lana and Edgar. Oh. She likes ballet. He's in depressed. I see one down there. At least I pulled that down before it happened.
actually wasn't much over here. What is that? Oh, whoa. What was that? Oh, it's a bird. Just kind of flew through. Back over. I'm gonna go ahead through this. <clears throat> Let's say I can take down the window painting. baggage <clears throat> Ow! oh sorry ah, you must be the towel boy you want an autograph I don't just hand those out and that's a good lesson for you anticipate disappointment take me I'm the greatest bullfighter who's ever lived, yet my upcoming match against the town bull has received virtually no marketing support. A towering advertisement was supposed to have been painted just outside my window. But as you can see, the job hasn't even been started. I think that bull is trampling anyone who tries to paint on the wall. Maybe you could stop it. Hmm. So instead of challenging the bull before a stadium packed with screaming women, you want me to fight it on the street in front of one dog and one child wearing a crude towel boy disguise. That's a okay. terrible idea. Here's a better one. You go get that billboard painted and I'll reward you handsomely, which is how I do it. As an advance, I'll give you one of my secret weapons. Use it if anyone gets stubborn. Confusion! I'm all the way back here. I see where I'm at. Well then. Um, was it there? Back towards the beginning.
I'll take that. Took a lot of damage there. I'll take all the mental health I can. button in here. I think that might be coming from the sewers. Oh! Hi! 
So that's where that goes. Don't care. Might be right, yes. Confusion grenade. Forgot I had that. Fusion gradients are actually really good. No? Uh, what do we got? Something I can climb. can take them down. But if I swap it with the rose painting. Yeah, I got roses. Okay. I feel like I need this for something. I should give this rose to someone who'd appreciate it. You guys appreciate roses? I am a mammal, so you're close. But perhaps you should save that for someone of your own species. Can go straight for the um, last card already. Help. Oh, kitty! Help. <sighs> the garden. Oh, well, the defeated. Um, a super in here. Edgar's love. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Hmm. Oh, she's cool. Curiosity. You don't say anything. Hey, I 
I just think it's great that you took that ass kicking I handed to you and turned that defeat into something positive. Like gardening. Grunt. So I found the garden. Hey, I just think it's great that you took that ass kicking I handed to you and turned that defeat into something positive. Like gardening. So how far am I on? Oh wow. Five more. I'm not missing any up here, am I? I still know I'm only five away though. Um I got all the webs. Yeah. was a dragon, right? Okay, let me go back. I don't know what to do with the roses yet. Also, wasn't there a fourth dog? I don't think I found the fourth dog. this out. Um, not too mad that I missed. <laughs> oh, I never talked to this Hey, one. uh, you really gotta get that billboard painted. Okay, man, here's the plan. Step one, I quit we. Step two, we, which is now just you, runs out there and gets killed painting the billboard. Maybe I can distract the bull while you paint. It's so crazy, it just might work. Or maybe it's so crazy that it's just extra crazy. There's absolutely no way I'm going out there, man. Come on, you're a bulldog. Show some backbone. Plus, who wants to go for a walk? Who wants to go for a walk? Who wants to go for a walk? Stupid <laughs> dog. Rain. All right, let's go. Great. When I say go, boy, get moving. Go, boy. Man, I can't take anymore. Why don't you confuse something else? Go, boy. Great, but I suppose it's just barely good enough. Come see me if you still want your reward. You know, your advice didn't work. Really? Then here's some new advice. I don't know what you're talking about. How about that reward? Fine then. One autograph. You know, my bulldog Frank could still paint a beer gun on that poster out there. All right, here, take this. But I warn you, I won't be able to sign it. Yay! Upgrade. Okay, let's go back. I think it turned out pretty well. On the other hand, I'm colorblind. So there's a bird that keeps on flying around here. Let's see if I can grab it. 
next time it goes through, of course. Shit. It went through. Never mind. Alright. Snake time. Next up, Junior King Kong Cobra! King Kong Cobra. Okay. Hey, Edgar. Nice headgear, freak. What? What? You suck, Ted. You can't beat me. Coach says I can't be beat. Coach says I got mental toughness. You can't break my concentration, whip. Hey, I'm not Edgar. Yeah? You're gonna wish you're not Edgar when I'm through. Look, I am not Edgar Tegley. My name's Raz. I'm a psychonaut. You're an idiot, Smedley. Coach says your psycho girl crazy lack of focus cost you states. Seriously, I don't want to have to hurt you. Well, since you'd have to break my concentration to even touch me, and since you can't break my concentration, I guess you won't be too disappointed then. So, I just gotta do this, right? Poseidon, you can't hurt me at all, because the coach taught you how to concentrate on not feeling pain. I don't know if I confuse you. Uh, I gotta back up. Okay, don't use anything, because I have no idea what's what. Oh, you got caught in it again. I beat you just like I did in high school, loser. Wait, who am I? Who am I? <laughs> a bowl. Just need to climb. Here you go. Here you go, Edgar. The last card. Thank you. You said you would get them, and you did. Not everyone is as good as they were, you know. Well, now you can finish your tower. Yes. Now this can all end. Once and Wow, it looks like you can walk right up there now, Edgar. Edgar? Edgar? Edgar. Someday, he just won't let me go. Tell me, how did you kill him? Kill who? El Odio. I didn't. Oh, yeah, that twist. Where he is, El Odio. <laughs> Thank you. 
Stuck in him. Uh, not quite. Preparing the pool, my humble picador. I shall now finish this beast off easily. Edgar, listen. There is no Elodio, no Lampita, no Dingo. What? You can't let the Junior Varsity Pep Squad ruin your life. Um, what's up with the Junior? Yeah, we were full on Varsity. <laughs> Give me a G. G. Give me an O. O. Give me a B. They B. stole Give me my a happiness, Give me an L. my life. Give me an the state semifinals. Everything. Never learns. Booty shake. Oh no! I can't believe I stuck four of those bar poles in his back. They're called banderillas. I gotta get those out of there and protect Edgar. If something happens to him while I'm in his mind, I'll get the boot. <laughs> <laughs> those out. So do I gotta stick them into him? Do that one time. Look out! No! El odio doesn't like that. Look out! Here comes El odio! Oh. Right in El odio's butt! Oh, no, I ran out. Coming into stuff here real quick. Recharge. Look out! Here's out! Stuck. El audio is dying. <sighs> oh, yeah. Uh, please, 
and you look at them. They're too pathetic to hurt you anymore. Can't you just let it go? How embarrassing. I can't believe I was hung up for so long over these losers. Um, uh, I, I always loved you more? Edgar. Signed, Edgar Tegle. Finny, when you deliver this to my Patronas, you may also hand him by farewell, for I am checking myself out of here. You have unchained my mind, young friend. So before I go, I'd like to show my gratitude by painting you a real work of art. No ball? <laughs> you make light of my mental problems, and still, I have no rage. Amazing! Alright. Let's continue. <clears throat> Alright. Let's put all this crap on. Greetings, Dr. Laporta. Good to see your face. I see you're wearing your favorite jacket. If I may say so, your claw is looking especially menacing today. Up to the secret laboratory, then, is it? Yes, please. That's where I would like Taking to go. Taking her up yourself this time, eh, Doctor? Less work for me. Inmate Look. Whitehead. Chief Orderly Bonaparte. You're... you're... Armed. Armed? Armed. <laughs> Well, here I am, up in the tower of an abandoned insane asylum, wearing a straitjacket, talking to myself. Okay, enough with the disguise. The things I do for Lily's brain. Well, if I'm gonna get to the top of this thing, I'd better start hiking. All right, time for the long hike. Mental health. All right, I got nine brains in here, sixteen cards, and a marker. Ah! Red. Tower or just this part? There's a rat that's stuck. I'll just leave you in there. Oh, shoot. Also, not that way. Oh, I know, that's... I know what that is, never mind. <laughs> Nothing there. Alright. Gonna go down. Nothing else upwards, right? 
Uh, it. No. I guess I'm going up. Brain. Who'd I thought? Bobby Zilch. <laughs> I didn't know you had a brain. <laughs> Man, I wish you were here for that joke, Bobby. Bobby. Yep. I love that it goes through a couple of them. There's a brain. Oh, me do. Maybe I should let JT have some time alone before I return this brain. <laughs> yeah, good do. All right. I think that's everything. Oh, there's a card over there. Ah! Fusion sucks. Got it. 
my brain. Dogen pool. Dogen. I told you I'd get your brain back. I found your Dogen. Okay. Got four more. And that's not even all of them. Oh yeah, I think there's a, a couple in the lab up above. If I remember correctly. Here for thinking.
One more card and one more brain. One more brain. Oh, I see the brain too. Actually did a pretty good job finding them all. To think that every cell in Nil's brain is dedicated to the ladies. <laughs> oh Nil. This is your last warning! Go back down right now or you'll be very, very sorry! Let's make a save. the tower. All right. This brain right there. We got three brains and four cards here. Workless! These brains are worthless, Shigar. <laughs> Just like the one in your head. Shigar. They're nice. They're, they're nice brains, Dr. Lovato. Really? They're too nice. They won't fight. I need killers. I need angry brains. I squeeze them. I poke them. I twist them. What do I have to do to make them fight? Maybe I should try my drill. I'm not going to bring you any more brains if you're going to be so mean to them. No matter what I do? No. No matter what? Not even if I... No, don't! Oh, not even if I cook no, no, you a little... No, no, A little turtle soup? Please, Dr. Lovato, no! A nice hot turtle soup. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nothing better on a cold night like this than some boiling hot soup. Okay. You sure? No! I mean, yes! <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, why don't I just go ahead and heat you up a cup? It's made of turtles! Turtles that you love! Isn't that right, Mr. Foggy Love? Okay, <laughs> Well, maybe I'll just make some for myself. Yeah! Bring me a good brain, Shigo! Oh, Mr. Pokey Loaf becomes Mr. Smokey Loaf. <laughs> Smokey Loaf. <laughs> when you're a dentist, you have to learn to have a sense of humor, you know. It helps to calm the patients down. Get Mr. Pokey the loop. I warned you not to come up here! They know you're coming! They're gonna take your brain! Listen! 
Listen, the man you're working for is a deranged lunatic. I know! I hate him! But if I don't do what he says, you... you... Cook your little turtle from the inside out. <coughs> she, your hostage situations like this are always extremely delicate. I'll have to extract Mr. Pokelope from his prison using my psychic powers. After which, this Lobato character should be fairly trivial to neutralize. Yes, because once we get Mr. Pokelope back, he'll tell us what to do. He always tells me what to do. Uh... Yes? Sure. <laughs> Sasha, Mia, Lily... Raz, you came! Of course I did. We gotta get you out of here. Look! The coach must have lured Sasha and Mia here on official Psychonauts business and then ambushed them with sneezing powder. They're completely brainless. I know. I saw their brains downstairs. Listen, first things first. I was thinking about what you said about us making out. Yeah? Oh, man. I'm so glad he showed up. I was just starting to feel slightly less phlegmy. Wait! He dinned us here. Ah! Get away from me! Stop reading my mind! Go rebrain Sasha and Mia so they can help us break this lock. First things first, Mr. Pokemon. Oh! Mr. Pokemon. Okay. Let's do this. Take Mr. Pokemon up and go downstairs. Man, come on, Mr. Pokelope, come and get your cake. There he comes. Mr. Pokelope. All right, let's go down. I was hoping for a way to go all the way down without having to do the climb. Was there really not a second way? I think this is where he is. There you are. Mr. Crowley, you gotta help. Kids are getting... Well, now, you see what happens when you go to parts of the forest that are off limits? Won't you help? I'm a ranger. I've got enough problems wrangling these leaves. Now, get! Ta-da! I'm done. Call me I the hunter. The whole scavenger hunt. Great. Holy Drake. I don't think anyone's ever done the whole thing before. Well, hold still. This might hurt. Ah. That felt good. Congratulations. Now get. Now get. All right. Where would? Uh. To the, parking, to the lot. parking lot. I hope you get something here real quick. 
thought so. Uh, 26. What is that? Three? Wait. Am I missing a card? I think I'm missing a card. I might be missing a card. Oh, it's a bear! Alright, I killed the bear. Man, this thing was old when they chopped it down. Let's see. 500 years ago, enormous titanium-bearing meteorite strikes the Earth, leaving a giant crater. 200 years ago, native inhabitants begin making arrowheads out of the titanium, which they call by the name Whispering Rock. This is a rough English translation. 100 years ago, prospectors and settlers take over the area, naming their boomtown Shaky Claim. 99 years ago, First case of paranormal hysteria diagnosed in shaky claim. 75 years ago, Houston Thorny builds his home for the demented to deal with the insanity epidemic. Uh, oh. So like the psychic activity is making people go crazy. 60 years ago, more residents in asylum than in the town. Houston Thorny commits suicide by leaping from tower. That is dark 55 years ago asylum closes last valley residents paid to leave by the federal government who flood the crater to prevent further habitation lake oblongata is created five years ago whispering rock psychic summer camp founded to nurture and train future psychopaths last summer i got to first base with elka doom signed nils lutefisk Man, this thing was old when they chopped it down. Let's see. Wow. <laughs> Anyways. So apparently I got a card missing somewhere. I'm gonna catch on fire. Watch it! I think I just need one more side core. Hey, any cake of Mmm, dream. Now, you take that side core there. I'll take it. Sold to the big headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Now, mm, now you take that so side core one. there. Put it together with That's nine side now. card. Alright, go get more airheads and come on back. Support your local merchants. Support your local merchants. Okay. Ooh. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Okay, to the thing show. Yes. Oh wait. I should have got two more. Where would you like? Nowhere. Pop in. Oops. Hang on. Let me go get one more. Where would once I get myself going to uh the lot. Oh. I forgot the um webs. Those make uh cards. Anything take a look? Mmm, now, you take that side core there, put it together I'll take with it. not excellent choice. What else can I do you for? Now, I'll take it. You take excellent choice. What else can I do you for? I'll take it. Excellent choice. What else can I'll I do you for? It. Sold to the big headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Take it. Excellent choice. What else can I do you I'll for? Take it. Excellent I'll choice. Take it. Excellent I'll what else can I do you for? Alrighty then. What else can I do you for? That's it for now. Alright. Go get more airheads and come on back. 
really. I shouldn't need that many more. Because I'm at like 94, I should only have Where would you like seven to more you levels. Color? Okay. Let's go. To yeah. Let's go. Probably have more cores than I need. Probably is it? Oh, that is infinite. Yep. Okay, huh. that's a good yep. upgrade. Yep. All right, I got some brains. Yep. Up here. Well, the good thing about you finding that kid's brain. Besides the whole thinking and feeling they'll be able to do now, is that they will be adding their subconscious mental attention to your quest, and their energy will increase your mental health potential. That sounds great. But is the surgery going to be dangerous? Nothing's dangerous when you have the right tools. Messy, <laughs> yes, but not dangerous. Funnel. And so that's why, even though she is a girl, and we are good friends, she is not technically my girlfriend. Well, I can tell you one thing. My dad is never going to send me to this camp again. Where's Kitty? Never mind. Is this going to go her. through everybody? So, as oh, you wow. can imagine, we are in some bad trouble. Sounds like it's time something bad happened to our fine coach. Well, let me tell you what our plan is. Please, you have your plan, I have mine. But say no more. Say no more. And that's how the coach is planning to take over the world. <laughs> wow, that is so not chill. Hey, where's Phoebe? We're gonna be rebraining her really soon. Well, when she comes out, she's gonna want to hit stuff. I'd better go wait by her drums. <laughs> and so, long story short, we're hoping for the best, but preparing for the worst. Well, there's only one thing that can make this better. Pedicure. See ya. Pedicure. And that's why we have to find Lily right away. That is some crazy I mean, stuff, guys. I'm kind of glad I was out for most of it. Well, with the world ending and everything, I, know I should Lily probably is. go see what girls want to make out one last time. So I say Brainer. I don't even know her. <laughs> Crystal. So, any questions? Is Elton okay? Well, he'll be fully brained soon. I promise. When he comes out, tell him I'm waiting for him down by the docks, okay? Hey, do you want to help us save the... Typical. Typical. So that's who's been kidnapping all the kids. Oh, man. I just want to burn that coach. Hey, where's Quentin? He's waiting for you with band practice. Oh, he enough. better not be painting the wrong band name on my drums again. <laughs> the end. The end. Okay, here's the plan. I'm gonna go get on the coach's radio and call for help. See, now that's an excellent idea. Why can't everyone be so helpful? Yeah, I modified the antenna, so now it broadcasts straight into outer space. Oh, man. Oh, man. And that's why we need your help more than anybody's. Well, shut my mouth. I better go patrol the living quarters, guard the women folk and all. Say, is my hombre walking around yet? Not yet, but soon. I just hope he forgives me for acting like such a dang fool. And that's why finding your brain in particular was my highest priority. You know, I'll bet if JT wasn't so distracted, this wouldn't have happened. He's probably with that prissy little show pony right now. No, actually I think her mind's on other things at the moment. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll go see what's up. One of us at least should be guarding the sleeping quarters. No, I promise you, you didn't drool at all. Is Milka okay? Yeah, she's waiting for you down by the docks. Gotcha. 
Hey, do you want to help us save the... Okay, is making out all anyone thinks about in this place? <laughs> and that is how I beat the hideous hulking lungfish of Lake Oblongata. Hmm. So, does the coach, uh, does he have an evil sidekick? A yes man? Or a lick spittle? Anything? Not sure. Why? Uh, no reason. No Bye. Reason. Scared? You better believe I was scared. You'd have to be a fool not to be. But the trick is to never let them see you sweat. Wow. I guess that's what those squirrels were trying to tell me. Huh? What? <laughs> they kept saying the tiny man is gonna kill everyone. I thought they were talking about me. Oh man. I have to go apologize. That's a good question. But I didn't taste it, so I don't really know the answer for sure. Well, if Brain Tank come after Mikhail, it will be sorry. Better go find Tiny Boss, see what his plan. Find Tiny Boss, see what his plan. And then, the lungfish ate me. And we became best friends. Oh my god! I know! I mean... Oh my god! I know! Nils! Nils! Yes, and because you got your brain stolen and I didn't, yes, I do. I think I'm better than you. Aha! I knew it! Well... <laughs> You're wrong! Have fun dying! And so that's what happened to your brain. Wow, what an amazing story. I mean, that is a really, really good story. And you know what the best part is? I'm in it. I, I better it. go write that whole thing down before we all get killed. And that's how I earned all my merit badges. Gee, I feel so stupid for throwing myself off the roof now! Uh... What? Why'd you throw yourself off the roof? Because the poison didn't work. Listen, I have to go! The world could use some major league cheering right about now! Agent Cruller? What is the current situation? Uh... I'd better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Okay. Wait. Mr. Pokilo. Do you want to talk to Mr. Pokilo? I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. And I'm glad to see you made some new friends. After all, your old ones got the brain sucked out. <laughs> all right. Who else wants to meet Mr. Pokilo? Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Um, the kids' cabin. Take me to the kids' cabins area. With pleasure. Say hi to everyone. Before I get finish this. Hello? I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. Uh, my dad bought me a bigger turtle than that for my birthday. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. Glad you finally got a friend. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. No, I can't mess around with Mr. Pokilo. I've got to give him back to Shigor right away. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. Better go put that little guy somewhere safe. There's a war on right now, you know. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. Uh, nice to meet you, Mr. Hello. Better keep that little head tucked away until we give the all clear. Let's talk to the squirrels again. Nobody in here. And so I'm really sorry for not believing you. Right. Yeah, that too. I should really not have blown so many of you up. I just get so confused sometimes. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. Hi, I like your hat. I like your hat.
are just visitors from another galaxy who never left. Their shells are actually atmospheric re-entry heat shields. <laughs> Everyone knows that. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. Turtles are stupid! <laughs> so your buddy's gone. Should have been a good bit of them. Anybody here? Oh, they're here. Oh, they're well, they're someone. Someone's here. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokelope. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokelope. Oh, Mr. Pokelope. I wish I had a hard shell like yours around my heart. <laughs> around my. I'd heart. like you to meet Mr. Pokelope. Mister. Don't you have any female friends you can introduce me to? <gasps> Pig! Yeah, that was a bit much. That thing's still down there. Let's get inside. Let's see if anybody's in here. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokemon. Hey, little turtle. Careful with that crown if you do any stage diving, okay? Don't worry, Mr. Pokilo. I'll get you back to Shigor right away. I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokilo. Okay, Mr. Turtle. This next song is going out to you. Oh, man. Gotta work a little turtle with a crown into the story somehow. Hmm. Maybe he can be my little wisecracking sidekick. No, I can't mess around with Mr. Pokilo. I've got to give him back to Shiwa right away. Nobody watching TV. Oh. Alright. Don't think I found everybody. Let me try the lake real quick. Fired. Just him. I hope it counted. Hi. Nope. Oh no. Mia. Oh. The mental minx. I already know she's at. <laughs> Okay. I need to pee real quick. So, um, 
I'm gonna be right back. Resume. Welcome back, you two. Let's continue. I'm trying to find the rest of my uh, campmates. Yeah, of course, that doesn't say who. Because I don't think I ran into him. Mikhail. Or Benny. For sure. And I'm pretty sure there's a few more. I haven't seen. Anybody's over here. Oh, wow. Well, that was the quickest I've uh, killed one of them. Oh, the she gets what, too? Yay, Mr. Christian! You gotta help. You gotta kill me, son. <laughs> I can't take the cheering anymore. I'm sorry I put their brains back. Maybe a bear will get them soon. Maybe. If not, you gotta find my drain cleaner and pour it down my throat, okay? <laughs> mop, mop! Mop! I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokelo. Three cheers for Mr. Pokelo! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! I'd like you to meet Mr. Pokelo. A little more than I thought it was gonna be. Alright, I think the only place I haven't looked is the uh, parking lot. Definitely missing stuff. Nobody went on top of the uh building, did they? Anybody over here? Oh. 
I'm just curious if anyone's on top of this. Probably not. I have a weird place for someone to be. have a few missing that I have not run into yet. And that is slightly concerning. Do you then go to Sasha's lab maybe? Anybody in here? Nope. I wasn't sure if any of the kids came down here out of curiosity. Why are you stopping? Oh, I thought you stopped. No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's go. Nope. Nobody just watching TV. Finally, everybody's gone, and I can watch whatever I want. <laughs> Do over. Two, three, four. on top 
the building over there. None of them went to the island. Yes, no. I don't know where everyone went. <laughs> Agent Crawler? What is the car? Think of landmarks where the kids might have went to. found anybody over here yet. Kind of makes me think there might be somebody somewhere. Oh. I beat the best. 
there. Go to the island? At all? Let me take the bathosphere? <laughs> People are missing? Kids' brains have been stolen? Coach Oleander is trying to take over the world! Won't you help? Mr. Pokalope to everybody, but I don't know where everybody is. Because I think I'm still missing the two that were here. I don't know where they are. I got the achievement on this. I've got to give him back to Shiro right, right let's away. Go back. Curiosity. Just getting everything. And revisit all the brains after I beat the game. Okay. Time to return Mr. Brickley though.
took him for a trip. Recranialization of an adult brain without surgery is... That's a very advanced procedure. How did you know how to do it? Well, I've studied it a little. But Shigor here knows more about handling brains than anyone I've ever met. Really? You know I've been thinking about getting a lab assistant. Oh, Shigor, darling, do you know where all of the other children's brains are? I've already brought well, them all back. you can lead us to them. We can bring them back to their owners immediately. Ahem. Immediately after we break young Miss Zanato here out of her restraints. Uh. Hey, I did it. Auto saving the point of no return. At least he never got inside your brain. It's going to take me weeks to get my rhythm back. Rasputin, you have surprised us yet again. I cannot thank you enough for what you've done. Hey, hey, all in a day's work for a psychonaut. <laughs> well, psy cadet, you mean. Hey, the psychonauts should be so lucky to get someone like Raz. The brain he's got in there is... one in a million. Thanks to all of you for bringing it straight to my door. <gasps> Oleander. You! You took all my friends' brains. You turned an innocent fish into a giant monster. You stole all the teachers, derailing my education. And you kidnapped my girlfriend. Rasputin, this fight is too big for you. Back home, I had to clean up after the elephants. So trust me, I know how to take care of this ugly little pile of... Kids, let the grown-ups handle this. You tall people! You tall people. <clears throat> Sasha! We get to kill him too! Uh, 
Well, it's official. The genius is back. Time to go get ready for my gallery show. Uh -oh. Uh oh, this looks bad. Ah, well, that's good. Someone must have turned off the gas long ago. Oh, here's what my poor flowers need. A little water. Oh, Such no, I spilled all my turpentine and acetone. Long time no see. Oh, Mr. Orderly. I did not see you there. I was just taking a little therapeutic walk in the moonlight. Relax. The asylum's closed. We can all go home. Leave? Here? Yeah, this place is for crazy people. And I don't know about you, but I ain't crazy no more. I have to tell you, I'm Twitch. feeling pretty good. You know... Maybe it is time for us all to move on. What do you think, Boyd? You ready to blow this popsicle stand? And that fixed Boyd. The milkman has completed his route. You guys want to split a cab? And the crib wasn't even that clean. I mean, what do I have to do to get those guys to take me seriously? When are you going to shut up and kiss me? Um, I can hear that. I know. <laughs> Surrender! Never! Psychonauts have a word for people who turn on their own. Ha! I don't need the Psychonauts anymore. I'm making my own army. Got a word for that? Yeah. Gesundheit! Huh? Ah! 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 <laughs> my fight i was ready for that one always in such a rush rasputin it takes years before you're ready for combat of that magnitude well you'd be surprised nine this one's been acing all my extra credit exams i beat the coach once already and i can do it again darling that was just a remote projection of the coach he wasn't as strong as he would be if he were to appear in the real world TV. <laughs> TV. Where's his brain? Oh, probably stuck in one of his plans to take over the world somewhere. <laughs> That's the problem. Hey, how's the weather down there? Ah, finally! 
Alone at last, eh, Rasputin? Glad you're finally picking on someone your own size. Yes, I've been dying for a chance to pick your brain! Two can play that game. Yeah, but only one can win. <laughs> All right. He's making a bear. Agent Kruller, do you have any advice on the current situation? You have to TK rubble against rubble. Break a hole big enough in the first ring so you can get in and set fire to the inner ring. Then TK a hunk of masonry right on that idiot's brain. Nothing more to report at this time. Crawler out. Okay, so Repairing it again. Too bad to get in there. TV. 
Oh, this is just great. Now what am I going to do? Have to think. <laughs> like I got a choice. <laughs> like I got a choice. Get my brain. Oh, oh. Hi, my name's Marcel Oleander, but you can call me Maury or Oli. Coach Oleander? What are you doing in my mind? How did you get in my happy meadow? Nobody's supposed to know about it. You didn't tell my dad about it, did you? <laughs> oh, that's him! Oh no! Come on, little bunny! We'll be safe in here! I remember from my childhood was definitely not made of meat. The last time I checked. No, no! Last time I checked. Little buddy, don't go in there! That's a bad place! That's a bad place for bunnies! All right. Uh, um, <laughs> like I need it. Trunk tag for this guy. <laughs> okay, my health is already all the way up. Which means I need you much wiser. Why do you still hold your goods like a miser? And yeah, so you've scavenged the webs, the cards, and brains just to redeem them. Is all that remains. Oh. Okay. So you can turn in stuff to him. So once I get the last cobweb, that'll be it. Like all the figments. I need the steam of trunk tag for this guy. Have your tag. Which tag did I get? Okay. The tall boy. Oh, is that it? Thing. That's good. You gotta help me save the bunny! If you just hold still, I could catch him and hide him from my dad! He runs a butcher shop. He wants to make food out of them. Oh, that's right. Mari's old man was a butcher. It looks like your childhood memories of the circus got all mixed up with his childhood memories of his dad's butcher shop. My memories were bad enough. This is just gross. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. You'd better keep that kid out of trouble. With your brains all scrambled like this, what happens to him happens to you. Uh... 
Did I just hit him? Sorry. Anything I can do with the bunny to protect it? To get them out of the way? Maybe hold it. Okay. Oh, I got you, Mr. Bunny. Oh. to another thing. There's two of them. Hold the money. Fun, fun, fun. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh, I got you, Mr. Bunny. <laughs> Once again, it keeps on going to a place where there's another thing. Actually, it might have been better to clear this place off of Figment and then go. I think he like recovers every time. Ow! My face! My face! 
Let's do it. Start from the beginning? Oh, that sucks. Guess I don't have to worry about figments for a little bit. Yeah, yeah, it's a platform. I missed that. to this one. That's an alternative way of doing that. Skip the um, sword stuff. Oh, 
just part of my current issue. Survive long enough for me to get. before I can get up there again. thing that like teleports me to the the last platform. Yeah, he's so dead. Failing before I can even get to him. Help! I'm not gonna hurt you. Are you really stuck? This is the one to keep on failing on. Let's try to do it this time. I'm 
Actually, can I just jump up there? Yeah, I can. Wait, was that a double fine one? <laughs> like, was that in the shape of the double fine mascot? More secrets. I guess I got all of those. Come on! This is my favorite ride! Tunnel of Love. <laughs> oh, they're still shooting at me. permanently dies. Yep. <laughs> so I don't think you can really miss anything, it's just making sure you jump whenever there's an empty spot. Oh! Fun. Oh no, that's all. Well, I can go back for the other one. Okay, I got it. Ah! Had to die, but I got it. All right, let's try that again.
Those monsters are gone now. The bunnies are safe. We're all safe. No! It's not safe! He's coming! Who's coming? My dad! Your dad? The butcher? He says little bunnies are good for nothing! Nothing but food! Here, little bunnies! Ah! Don't run, or else daddy's gonna kill ya! On here. What have you done to our circus? Dad! Polluted. Perverted. This looks like the work of mentalists. I can explain. Have you been associating with psychics? Dad, I... 
psychics. Fortune tellers. They killed your grandfather. They cursed our entire family to die in water. Yes, but... Including you, Rasputin. And me. But I'm going to live. You know why? Because I'm still an acrobat. Let's see if you are. What's it going to be, son? Die in the water? Or show me what you got? you taught me. Don't lie to me, cheater. You crystal ball readers always cheat. You're no son of mine.
skull is as hard to penetrate as ever. Dad! What is your brain doing out here in this tank with this other brain? And who are all these unconscious people? What have you gotten yourself involved with? Psychics. He's been cavorting with filthy, cheating psychics. Is that really? Is that really how I look in your mind? Man, do I hate psychics. And seeing my son happy. I don't hate psychics. I used my psychic connection with you to find you and to project myself into your mind. But how can you hate me for being psychic if you're psychic too? Son, I could never hate you. I only wanted you to be happy, Rasputin, and safe. Our family has many enemies. <laughs> a lot more hair than that. Now, son, we have to carefully unweave your psyche from that other brain. We don't want anything bad to happen while your mind is in this tangled state. The damage could be permanent. <laughs> unweave? Detangle? Never. I like it this way. I mean... Look at how huge I am! And I think I can juggle now! <laughs> this is your mind, so you are the strong one here. But I'm about to give you, my son. You must take care of it, because it's everything I've got.
bunnies. No, no meat. <sighs> no more. No more meat. Look. There you go. Good little bunny. <laughs> hey, thanks for helping me save the bunnies. And for talking to my dad. Uh, no problem, little Ollie. Bye-bye. Wave goodbye, Mr. Bun. <laughs> Where's he going? We're separating the brains now, Rasputin. He'll be fine. Let's go inside. Man, I can't wait to tell you about all the messed up stuff that happened. Oh, I know a lot of it. While you were out, I poked around a bit. Tell me about this lily person. Hey! And so, that brings us to the end. Where, as you can clearly see, the personal demons causing my negative behavior have all been eradicated, leaving me sane once again. This is also corroborated in catch scan number three on page 59 of your handouts. Mm -hmm. On a personal note, I would just like to reiterate how extremely, extremely sorry I am for stealing all of your brains and trying to take over the world. Mistakes have been made, but this camp is all about education. And I know I, for one, learned plenty. Thanks to that guy right there. Come on up here, Raz. We endeavor to build strong minds here, with the power to lift things, to see things, to burn things. But it's a special quality of your heart, not your mind, that truly makes a great psychonaut. This young man has it. We did not give it to him. He got it from someone else long before he came here. But we can give him this, to honor his mind, his courage, and his heart. Son, we do not normally ask this of someone so young, but it is obvious to us all that you are not average. Will you join us, Rasputin? Will you be a psychonaut? <gasps> Summer's not over yet. We can hang out for a couple of weeks still. My family's out on the East Coast. Where's yours? They move around a lot. Hmm. Well, you'd better go. Your dad's waiting for you. Um, well... Bye. Children, it's an emergency. There's been another kidnapping. I was here the whole time. You saw me. No, this time we know who it is, and that's what scares us. Who was kidnapped? Truman Zanotto, the grand head of the Psychonauts. Dad! Sir, can you teleport this many of us back to headquarters? Huh? What? Hey, hey, what are all you people doing in my kitchen? Now get! Guess we're taking the jet. Don't worry about your dad, darling. We'll get him back. Yes, after all, we'll have Rasputin helping us. I'm going? Now how could we do this without our anti-kidnapping specialist? I've taught you everything I can, son. Now, you go show them. Show them all. Let's go.
great to see you guys all together. Shh. Not now, Rasputin. There is a lot of money on the table. Okay. I was just gonna hang out for a bit. Is that bull? Long gone, my friend. The place is yours, if you excuse me. Okay. Hey, great hand. Good thing we found all those queens, eh? Ah! Not much to do here except clean up all the cobwebs, collect all the figments, and get any faults that are left. I should find a proper hook for this painting, so it will... Hmm.
Hey, I just think it's great that you took that ass kicking I handed to you and turned that defeat into something positive. Like gardening. I should give this rose to someone who'd appreciate it.
great to see you guys all together. Not now, Rasputin. There is a lot of money on the table. Enough. Have a good one.